Hello kids. I'm Miss Julie. We have already learned how to round off the numbers. Today, based on the same concept, we will learn estimating the sum. So, let's begin. Let us estimate the sum by rounding off to the nearest hundred and also find the actual sum of the given numbers. Here, to estimate the sum, firstly, we round off the numbers to the nearest hundred. So, 532 is rounded off to 500 and 274 is rounded off to 300. Next, add the numbers obtained to get the estimated sum. Thus, the estimated sum is equal to 500 plus 300, which is equal to 800. To find the actual sum, we add 532 plus 274 is equal to 806. Thus, the actual sum is 806. Now, let us quickly solve one more example. Here, to estimate the sum, round off the numbers to the nearest thousand. So, 6524 is rounded off to 7000. And 3171 is rounded off to 3000. Thus, the estimated sum is equal to 7000 plus 3000 which is equal to 10,000. Now, let us find the actual sum. So, 6524 plus 3171 is equal to 9,695. Kids, why not you all try solving a few examples on your own? Hello kids, we have already learned how to round off the numbers. Today, based on the same concept, we will learn estimating the difference. So, let's begin. Let us estimate the difference by rounding off to the nearest hundred and also find the actual difference of the given numbers. Here, to estimate the difference, firstly, we round off the numbers to the nearest hundred. So, 345 is rounded off to 300. And 138 is rounded off to 100. Next, subtract the numbers obtained to get the estimated difference. Thus, the estimated difference is equal to 300 minus 100 which is equal to 200. To find the actual difference, we subtract 138 from 345 to get 207. Thus, the actual difference is 207. Let us quickly solve one more example. Here, to estimate the difference, Round off the numbers to the nearest thousand. So, 7,328 is rounded off to 7,000. And 4,142 is rounded off to 4,000. Thus, the estimated difference is equal to 7,000 minus 4,000, which is equal to 3,000. Now, let us find the actual difference. So, 7,328 minus 4,142 is equal to 3,186. Kids, why not you all try solving a few examples on your own? Estimating the product
Let us estimate the product of 5,965 and 4,958 by rounding off each number to the nearest thousand. Here, to estimate the product, we round off the digits to the nearest thousand. So, 5,965 is rounded off to 6,000. And 4,958 is rounded off to 5,000. Now, let us multiply the numbers obtained to get the estimated product. Thus, the estimated product is equal to 6,000 multiplied by 5,000, which is equal to 3 crore. Estimating the quotient. Let us estimate the quotient for 77,439 divided by 1,125 by rounding off each number to its greatest place. The number 77,439 is rounded off to the nearest 10,000. We get 80,000. 1,125 is rounded off to the nearest thousand and we get 1,000. Hence, the estimated quotient is equal to 80,000 divided by 1,000, which is equal to 80.